Serious Side Effects of Turmeric Today, we'll delve into the intricate world of turmeric and curcumin, exploring not only their numerous benefits, but also shedding light on the 10 potentially perilous side effects associated with their usage. Our subject of interest, turmeric, a natural spice rooted in ancient traditions, has found its place in the spotlight due to its medicinal properties. Consuming it in the range of 500 to 2000 milligrams per day is a common practice often discussed in the rich tapestry of Hindi culture, widely acknowledged as safe and non-toxic. When incorporated into one's diet, turmeric boasts a wealth of research, highlighting its anti-inflammatory prowess and multifaceted applications. In certain studies, turmeric has outshone conventional anti-inflammatory drugs like ibuprofen, underlining its potential therapeutic superiority. However, as with any remedy, there are caveats to consider. And that's precisely what we'll delve into in this comprehensive discussion. The distinction between turmeric and curcumin becomes crucial in our exploration. Turmeric encompasses the plant or root, which may not always be in its purest form, harboring elements like oxygen. In contrast, curcumin stands out as the active compound within turmeric often present in supplements at a concentrated 95 percent this revelation prompts a shift in focus from turmeric to curcumin when navigating the supplement landscape prepare to uncover the insider secrets on maximizing the benefits of turmeric can curcumin without breaking the bank from alleviating osteoporosis and joint pain to becoming one of the most sought after nutritional supplements globally these golden wonders offer an array of advantages. Diving into the scientific intricacies, turmeric and curcumin operate on a multifaceted level, inhibiting cytokine necrosis factor, COX2, lipoxygenase, and functioning as potent antioxidants. Their influence extends to cell growth modulation and the induction of apoptosis or programmed cell death, potentially making them formidable allies. In certain cancer treatments, however, as we count down the biggest side effects, it becomes evident that even these potent compounds are not without their risks. Ten significant side effects will be dissected, offering a balanced perspective on the pros and cons, and addressing the crucial question of who should consider incorporating turmeric and curcumin into their regimen. Join us as we navigate the labyrinth of turmeric's complexities and unravel the nuances that define its impact on our well-being. Let's delve into the realm of potential pitfalls on our journey through the effects of turmeric and curcumin. Starting with a cautionary number 10, skin reactions. The research landscape has been illuminated with documented cases of allergies, notably contact dermatitis, raising a red flag for those venturing into the world of turmeric-infused remedies. These findings prominently feature in the 2009 Journal of Contact Dermatitis underscore a crucial consideration for anyone contemplating the incorporation of turmeric into their skincare routine. The allure of its potential benefits may be overshadowed by the stark reality that, for some, the introduction of turmeric can trigger discomfort manifesting as itching and peeling. It's a wake-up call to exercise prudence and mindfulness, as your skin might not react favorably to the golden elixir. The intricacies of individual responses demand a keen awareness of the potential for contact dermatitis. So, if you're embarking on a turmeric-laden skincare journey, do so with eyes wide open and a healthy dose of caution. Number 9 on our cautionary list brings us to a topic of utmost importance, especially for expectant mothers, the limited research on turmeric's effects during pregnancy. As we navigate this complex landscape, it becomes evident that, despite turmeric's widespread acclaim, there exists a significant gap in our understanding of its impact on pregnancy. Recent studies published in pharmacology journals, with a notable surge in 2018, have cast a spotlight on concerns surrounding the use of turmeric during pregnancy. These findings suggest that treading cautiously is the prudent approach for expectant mothers. The lack of comprehensive research leaves a void in our knowledge, making it challenging to definitively determine the safety and potential risks associated with turmeric consumption during pregnancy. As we delve into the realms of maternal health, it's essential for pregnant individuals to approach turmeric with a discerning eye. The potential ramifications of its usage 
on both maternal well-being and fetal development warrant careful consideration. This pivotal revelation serves as a reminder that, in the realm of holistic wellness, a nuanced understanding is key, especially when it comes to the delicate balance of pregnancy. Now, turning our attention to the eighth concern on our list, the intricate relationship between turmeric and blood pressure. Whether it's on the low or high end of the spectrum, the notion that elevated doses of turmeric might excessively lower blood pressure, particularly in individuals concurrently using antihypertensive medications, is a topic that warrants careful consideration in a significant revelation reported in a 2014 journal of renal nutrition. It was disclosed that certain medications, akin to beta blockers, exhibit blood pressure lowering effects. This raises a red flag for those seeking to incorporate turmeric into their routine, especially if they are already on medications with similar effects. Let's dissect these potential risks. If your blood pressure tends towards the lower end, exercise caution before introducing turmeric into your regimen. The cumulative effect of turmeric and blood pressure lowering medications might lead to an undesirable outcome. This underlines the crucial importance of mindful consideration, ensuring that the potential benefits of turmeric do not inadvertently tip the delicate balance of blood pressure to those already on antihypertensive medications. The cautionary note resonates even more profoundly. The interplay between these drugs and turmeric could have unintended consequences, and it becomes imperative to consult with healthcare professionals before embarking on a journey that involves both turmeric supplementation and blood pressure management. Let's unravel the complexity surrounding our seventh concern the intricate connection between turmeric and gallbladder issues or cramps. This is a crucial consideration, especially for those grappling with gallbladder pain and abdominal complications. The potential repercussions of turmeric on the gallbladder come to the forefront, unveiling one of the most substantial side effects, the onset of nausea, vomiting, cramps, and diarrhea. The gallbladder plays a pivotal role in the digestive process, by producing bile, turmeric, when introduced into the system, exerts pressure on the gallbladder, potentially exacerbating existing pain and discomfort. A comprehensive study in 2011 delved into this intricate relationship, serving as a cautionary tale for those contending with gallbladder problems, for individuals who have a history of gallbladder surgery, gallstones, gallbladder disease, or cholecystitis. The inclusion of turmeric may not be the panacea they seek. Turmeric stimulation of bile production could potentially aggravate pre-existing conditions, necessitating a thoughtful evaluation of the risks involved. It's a stark reminder to exercise prudence when considering turmeric as part of your wellness regimen, especially if gallbladder issues are a part of your health narrative. The delicate balance between the potential benefits of turmeric and its impact on specific health conditions requires a discerning eye and, perhaps, consultation with healthcare professionals. Our exploration into potential concerns with turmeric brings us to the sixth issue, an elevated risk of kidney stones. This is a topic that often surfaces in discussions about turmeric, particularly in the context of oxalate content. Dr. Stephen Gundry, acclaimed for his insights in the plant paradox, has shed light on the oxalate kidney disease connection, sparking both interest and debates. While some argue that concerns about kidney stones may be exaggerated, it's essential to address this issue responsibly. Turmeric, renowned for its impressive anti-inflammatory properties, contains a substantial amount of oxalates, a fact that cannot be overlooked. The paradox lies in the simultaneous potential for inflammation reduction and oxalate-induced inflammation. A notable 2008 study, published in the American Journal of Clinical Nutrition, delved into the increase in urinary oxalate concentration following turmeric consumption. This finding underscores the validity of concerns regarding kidney stones for those with a history of related conditions. The nuanced relationship between turmeric, oxalates, and kidney health demands careful consideration especially for those predisposed to kidney stones. Interestingly, the paradox deepens when we distinguish between curcumin, the potent compound within turmeric known for its renal benefits, and the spice itself. While curcumin boasts antioxidant and anti-inflammatory effects, turmeric, in its entirety, 
contains oxidants. This brings to light the importance of moderation and hydration when incorporating turmeric into one's routine, particularly for individuals prone to kidney stones. If a history of kidney stones or related conditions is part of your health narrative, exercising caution with turmeric intake becomes imperative. Consider consulting with healthcare professionals to strike the right balance between reaping the anti-inflammatory benefits of turmeric and mitigating potential risks to kidney health. As we delve into the fifth concern on our journey, through the potential side effects of turmeric, our spotlight falls on gastrointestinal issues. This is a critical consideration particularly when it comes to the dosage of turmeric, an essential factor that can tip the balance between its benefits and potential drawbacks at high doses. Specifically around 1,000 or even 500 milligrams, the risk of encountering gastrointestinal troubles, such as diarrhea, nausea, and stomach upset becomes a significant concern. These adverse effects were meticulously documented in the Journal of Clinical Pharmacology in 2013 shedding light on the repercussions of pushing turmeric consumption to the extremes. However, the dosage nuances are worth exploring. When incorporated in a reasonable amount, say 60 to 100 milligrams, such as a culinary addition to a dish, the concerns may diminish. It's the supercharged, high-dose supplements that often amplify the risk of gastrointestinal distress. This brings us to a critical point of consideration, the context of usage. While modest doses integrated into daily meals might pose minimal risk, the scenario changes when indulging in powerful 1.0 mg superfood supplements enriched with additives. It's this supercharged concoction that can potentially lead to digestive discomfort and other gastrointestinal problems. So, the key takeaway here is the importance of moderation, mindful dosing, and an awareness of the source and composition of your turmeric intake. Our exploration into the potential effects of turmeric brings us to the fourth concern, a paradoxical one, the capacity of turmeric to reduce blood sugar levels. While this might sound like a boon, it comes with its own set of cautions, especially for individuals dealing with diabetes. Extensive research has demonstrated that in some diabetic individuals, the consumption of turmeric can lead to a significant drop in blood sugar levels. It's a classic case of too much of a good thing potentially causing harm. For those actively managing diabetes, the goal is often to lower blood sugar levels, but a drastic reduction can have adverse consequences. A cautionary note arises from the risk of hypoglycemia, where blood sugar levels plummet to dangerously low levels. Symptoms such as dizziness and even loss of consciousness may manifest if the reduction is too abrupt. A study conducted in 2013 underscored this risk emphasizing the need for careful consideration, especially for those with diabetes. The paradox deepens when we acknowledge the positive role of curcumin, the active compound in turmeric. In managing diabetes, curcumin is believed to act as an antioxidant, reducing inflammation and improving insulin sensitivity, beta cell function, and aiding in sugar storage in the liver. For individuals with diabetes, the key lies in striking the right balance, leveraging the benefits of curcumin without plunging into the risks of excessively low blood sugar levels. Now, we delve into the third concern, the intricate world of drug interactions. This aspect stands as one of the most challenging realms in medicine, where navigating the complexities demands utmost caution. It's a reminder that when it comes to medications, such as blood pressure medications, diabetes medications, antibiotics, and others. Consulting with a healthcare professional is not just advisable, it's imperative. Turmeric, while celebrated for its natural properties, can pose challenges when coexisting with certain medications. The initial repercussions might manifest as stomach problems and adverse reactions, emphasizing the need for vigilant monitoring. However, the stakes are significantly raised when considering medications like warfare blood thinners for which numerous alternatives exist. The potential interaction with blood thinners introduces a myriad of complications. Turmeric may not only lower blood pressure excessively, but also thin the blood beyond a safe threshold, leading to a cascade of negative effects. The intricacy of these interactions is undeniable. 
prompting extensive research to unravel the nuances and implications. This complexity underscores the importance of transparency with healthcare providers about turmeric supplementation, especially when it coexists with a regimen of prescribed medications. Let's delve into the second concern, a potential hurdle that intertwines with iron deficiency, absorption issues, turmeric being fat soluble has the potential to inhibit the absorption of iron, presenting a significant consideration for those grappling with anemia. For individuals already at risk due to anemia, the 2009 findings in the Journal of Medicinal Food accentuate the potential side defects arising from this interaction, notably high doses of curcumin, the active compound in turmeric, have been linked to binding with iron in the intestines. Picture this scenario, you consume turmeric, rich in curcumin, and as it makes its way through your digestive system, it binds to iron. However, instead of this iron passing through the stomach lining, it forms a complex with curcumin, hindering its absorption. This cascade disrupts the synthesis of red blood cells, crucial for transporting oxygen throughout the body. As a result, fatigue and lethargy may set in. Symptoms familiar to those experiencing anemia. The irony lies in the fact that while turmeric is celebrated for its health benefits, its interaction with iron in this manner can potentially exacerbate the very condition it aims to alleviate. This intricate dance between turmeric and iron absorption raises a red flag for individuals already grappling with anemia. Additionally, the potential interaction with medications adds another layer of complexity, reinforcing the need for careful consideration and, where necessary, consultation with healthcare professionals. Now, let's shed light on another critical aspect that intertwines with drug interactions, the heightened risk of bleeding associated with turmeric. This concern, particularly pertinent for those on blood thinners, underscores the delicate balance needed when incorporating turmeric into your wellness routine. The primary worry surfaces when individuals, especially those on blood thinners, face a cut or injury. Turmeric's anti-clotting properties can impede the natural blood clotting process, making it challenging for wounds to seal. This heightened difficulty in forming blood clots can elevate the risk of internal bleeding, especially when turmeric is consumed in very high doses. Curcumin, the active compound in turmeric, exerts its influence at various stages of the blood clotting process. It not only prevents the formation of blood clots, but also inhibits specific clotting factors from functioning effectively. While this anti-inflammatory action is often celebrated as a positive attribute, acting as an anticoagulant, it also poses a double-edged sword. The delicate equilibrium between reaping the benefits of reduced inflammation and avoiding excessive bleeding is a crucial consideration. Too much turmeric, especially in conjunction with other blood thinners, can tip to scales, significantly increasing the risk of bleeding. This becomes particularly pertinent in scenarios involving surgical procedures where the potential for bleeding complications is amplified, especially for individuals on blood thinners or those considering surgery. The nuanced interplay between turmeric and blood clotting requires careful consideration and, when in doubt, consultation with healthcare professionals. Five benefits of turmeric. Now, let's shift our focus to the brighter side of the turmeric spectrum its multitude of benefits, unraveling the potential positive impacts. We'll explore five compelling reasons to welcome turmeric into your wellness routine. First and foremost, let's talk about skin health. In 2018, studies emerge, highlighting turmeric's remarkable anti-inflammatory and antibacterial properties. These properties position turmeric as a valuable ally in the quest for radiant, healthy skin. Its potential extends to addressing skin conditions, such as psoriasis, combating dry and flaky skin, and even contributing to the management of acne. The implications for skincare are indeed profound and worth considering. Let's venture into the second realm of benefits offered by turmeric, its positive impact on digestive health, despite the potential side effects, particularly diarrhea and nausea and consumed in high amounts, the moderation in its usage, such as adding it to food, can become a game changer for digestive well-being. In a noteworthy study conducted in 2020, 
turmeric emerge as a potential solution to reduce bloating. This revelation unveils promising prospects for individuals dealing with digestive issues, particularly those grappling with inflammatory owl diseases. The intricate dance between turmeric and digestive health holds the promise of a more harmonious and comfortable gut environment. Let's explore the third compelling benefit of turmeric, its positive impact on cardiovascular health. In a pivotal study from 2019, the spotlight is on curcumin and turmeric as potential game changers. In improving endothelial function, a critical aspect linked to heart health, this revelation unfolds the potential to not only reduce the risk of heart disease, but also enhance vascular health. The mechanisms at play align with the typical actions of anti-inflammatory agents like curcumin. Turmeric, with its rich curcumin content, emerges as a natural ally in promoting a healthier cardiovascular system. Let's delve into the fourth avenue of benefits offered by turmeric. Its positive impact on brain health and mood regulation. A groundbreaking study from 2021 published in the esteemed journal Frontiers in Psychiatry, shines a light on curcumin's potential role in treating symptoms of depression. This revelation opens the door to a deeper exploration into cognitive function and mental well-being. The prospect that curcumin, found abundantly in turmeric, may contribute to mood regulation and mental health is indeed intriguing. The implications of this study echo far beyond the culinary realm suggesting a potential ally in the quest for enhanced brain health. Let's unravel the pivotal fifth benefit, perhaps the most compelling one, of turmeric with curcumin at the forefront. This golden compound has been meticulously researched and earned its acclaim as a potent anti-inflammatory agent, effectively combating various inflammatory conditions, such as osteoarthritis, muscle pain, rheumatoid arthritis, and chronic inflammatory disorders. Intriguingly, a comprehensive meta-analysis, featuring insights from 66 studies, including high-level randomized controlled trials, and a myriad of other investigations, underlines the efficacy of curcumin and turmeric. The consensus across these studies is clear. Curcumin demonstrates significant potential in treating inflammation and alleviating symptoms associated with osteoarthritis, joint pain, and muscle pain. The breadth of these findings encompasses a diverse array of conditions, highlighting the versatility of turmeric in promoting overall well-being. The secret lies in curcumin's multifaceted action. It not only inhibits necrosis factors, cytokines, cyclooxygenase to lipoxygenase, but also acts as a powerful antioxidant. This dual role helps prevent damage to blood cells, especially endothelial cells, and regulate cell signaling. It's a nuanced dance where curcumin with its anti-inflammatory prowess. Not only signals the elimination of harmful cells, but also nurtures the growth of healthy ones. Before we part ways, I want to thank each and every one of you for joining me on this exploration. Your comments, likes, and shares mean the world to me. And now, as we bid farewell to this chapter, I encourage you to share your thoughts in the comments below. What did you find most intriguing? What topics would you like me to cover in future videos? Let's keep the conversation going.